Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I am joined by Hi! This is Brogan. Obviously leave all the links down Guess below. Who's back. back. Back again. again. Brogan's back. back. Tell a friend. We are that just was so insane. That was amazing. That that, that, really that was my heart. best moment of 2019 <laughs> of the whole decade. Well it's a good job we're in December, isn't it? <laughs> to the video idea. Idea? Yeah. Content? Whatever. Uh, we're doing quizzes. <laughs> because what a fun time. So on my channel, which is why you're here, we're doing a Panic at Disco quiz and then a Jeffree Star quiz. Um, I play this one on Spoke where you have to name all these lip colours and it's really stressful. Oh my God, I'm gonna take that from you. Um, <laughs> so yeah, that's what we're doing. That's, that's oh. not a lot I can say, to be oh, honest. Let me get my city <sighs> up. No. I'm stressed. It's called Safari. So we're gonna start off with only a true Panic at the Disco fan can pass this test. And I would like to point out, I know none of the answers, <laughs> but I appreciate them. Yes. High Hopes comes on the radio. It's the a banger of a tune. I feel like I'm a, I'm a really bad person because that's the only song that I like. No, I like that, um, is it Hey Look My I Made hey It? Hey Look My I Made It. When that comes on, I'm like, ooh. And then ooh, it goes, ooh, that was Panic at the Disco. I'm like, shut up. <laughs> okay, so. My phone is over there, I'm not cheating. Question one. How many p albums does Panic at the Disco have? So currently... This was made in 2017. Well done. Okay. You have... I'm not going to time you, so you so, <laughs> so they had a fever you can't sweat out, Pretty Odd, Vice and Virtues, Two Way to Live, Two Way to Die, Death of a Bachelor. That would have been that many at the time. Currently there's six, but the Pray for the Wicked came out after this quiz. So five. I'm gonna say five at the time of the quiz. Correct! Oh, my voice is really Killed going it. from... <laughs> Do you want a drink, love? <clears throat> no, it's fine. It's just... <laughs> I shouldn't blast out music first thing in the morning. When did members Ryan Ross and John Walker leave Panic at the Disco? Would dun, you dun, like dun. multiple choice? Or yes. do you know? Yeah, I, I think I know, but... So we've got 2006, 2008, 2009, 2011, 2014, or... They're still in the band! They are definitely not still in the band. Shoot. They're not dead, but I want to say R.I.P. Um, see, I was going to say 2010, and that's not an option. No. <laughs> so it must be 2009. Correct! It says, Ryan and John cited something. Creative differences as the reason for the split. Bullshit. Do you know what happened? No, this is not confirmed. This is just a little bit of gossip tea. Um... <laughs> Brendan and Ryan were having an affair, like they were together, and then they must, something must have happened, and then they left the band. Oh yeah, because he's married as Brendan, isn't he? He is and married. Everyone still thinks, yeah. No, it's it's Again. called uh, Ryden. That's the ship name. I don't personally ship Ryden. I'm more of a a, a Brallen kind of gal, but that's fine. Brallen. <laughs> Such a horrible <laughs> <ship> name. Brallen. <laughs> Even though they're both married, with well, no, one of them's got Anyway, Wait, you can still ship them in a bromance. Irrelevant. Just no, saying. you haven't seen the videos. I'm going to show you the videos there. I actually want to see them. Okay. <laughs> Panic at the Disco's first single. Would you like the the hint? The Yeah, why it's... not? Let's go for it. So Even though I think I know. Time to dance. Lying is the most fun a girl can do without taking her clothes off. Oh, that is so wrong. Such a good song. I though. write sins, not tragedies. <laughs> and the only difference between something just and... Just say suit... the only difference. You can just... Yeah, because I, I don't have to... No, I think it was the only difference because that was a radio single and then I write sins, not tragedies came out after. So and you that's what the last there. one? Yes. Correct! <sighs> I'm so scared for this Harry Potter quiz it. now. <laughs> so I'm going to show the camera first because it says, who is this? Okay. So... Who you no no you can look like oh, through the screen though. Oh, okay. Who is this? Is it gonna focus? Ah! That's my babe. That is my babe. I love him so much. That is Dallin Weeks. My absolute babe. You are wrong. No, I'm not imagine. <laughs> You've been like what? <laughs> it was the bass guy. He's not the bass player anyway. He's I babe. meant like the, the thing. He's cute. Okay. We love him. In what city? Don't worry, it's not, did they perform this song? Did say. Panic at the Disco originate? Uh, Las Vegas. Correct! <laughs> Don't know why I've taken on Morgan Adams' voice. I love it, voice. it's really great. Panic at the Disco started out as a cover band. Did you know that? No. <laughs> no, I did not know that. 
<laughs> but let's just go for it. Which band were they covering? Okay, what are my options? Green Day. O A R. Blink 182. And I swear to God, if it's this last one, I'm going to be fuming. Oasis. Cause it definitely is not Oasis. Because they are completely different music. Um, That's why the only reason why I kick off. Oh, what am I feeling? Between Green Day and, and Blink 182. It's going to be Blink 182. I'm feeling it. Blink 182. <laughs> it's probably wrong. <laughs> you are correct. Oh, no. oh my yeah. God. Amazing. I'm glad that you went with that actually because I don't think it would have been Green Day. I think Fall Out Boy did a bit of Green Day. Maybe. Which Panic at the Disco music video is this picture from? Uh, nah. Yeah, nine in the afternoon. No, 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 no. Correct. <laughs> I would not have known that if it well. were a question about One Direction. True or false? Okay, fine. I really am. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Panic of the Disco made an album that was never released. Never actually released. Is it true or is it false? Oh, I hate true and false questions. <laughs> they give me anxiety. Um, Ten. Not no, False. Okay. False. You're gonna go with false? Yeah. Wrong. Damn it. <laughs> the band had written songs for a follow-up album to A Fever You Can't oh, Sweat Out man, I would have loved to, to be released that. from 2000, in 2007. But those songs were scrapped because the band did not like the sound. Well, you know what? You missed yeah, out. To be honest, they released Pretty Odd after that and that album was a flop for me. Personal preference. Gonna get a little shady. Uh, Pretty Odd so is, is the worst job. album that they've ever done. It is. I just, I just want to say I do not agree with these sentiments. <laughs> Don't come at my you channel. Don't even know the album. <laughs> Which of the following songs has Panic at the Disco never covered? And I said oh off camera, God. if it's number one, come at me if you want. I'll lose respect for them. So number <laughs> one, The Wanted. Glad you came. Please don't tell me they covered that. Don't think they did. We'll carry on. Queen, Bohemian Rhapsody. I will gain a respect lot. for them. If they, they, they have did covered that. that a lot. I need to. You need to show me. That. I will show you that. Radiohead, Karma Police. They have definitely done that. And Third Eye Blind, Slow Motion. They would not have covered the Wanted. I'm okay. sorry. Thank that God. just would not happen. <laughs> My One Direction heart is so happy you said that. Correct. I used to have a friend that was obsessed with the Wanted, and then Panic at the Disco album received a Grammy nomination for Best Rock Album. In Death of a Bachelor. Can I press it? Yeah, you can press it. Correct! It was their first Grammy nomination, I'm so proud. Who is it? It was, they didn't Please tell me the Padam since. No. Death of a Bachelor was 2016, so they've got <clears> time. <throat> they might get one next year. Maybe. Who knows? Are they even still a band? And I, well, the reason why I ask is because he's got another band. Technically, it's just Brendan. It is. Technically, it's just Brendan doing it all by himself. He's but playing the songs. He's, he's got guitar and he's doing the piano. And he's the now records. got touring members. So there's the drummer Dan. We love Dan. He's been with them a long time. We've got Mike, the guitarist, after Kenny got sacked because he was a naughty boy to underage girls. Uh, and then they've got Nicole, the bass player, after Dallin left. We love Nicole. She's a little gem cake. And now Dallin's got his own band. Nice. Carry on, as you will. So, this is from 2017, remember? Okay, okay. yeah. Okay, Who is cool. Panic, at the Disco, go, Panic at the Disco's current drummer? See, I think Spencer left by then. So I'm going to say Dan. Dan. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Correct. <laughs> I got really confused because Dallin was in it and I was like... Dallin is not a drummer. Was Spencer in there? He yeah. was in there. Oh, we love Spencer. And that's Dan in case you want to know. Dan's a little gem. We love Dan. There you go. So, Jesus Christ. Well, no, I said Christ. that about Kenny, but that didn't turn out well. <laughs> oh, we won't talk about him. <laughs> <laughs> From what song are the lines... Just get, you, get, you, get your juices going. What? We sound so wrong. <laughs> so... Kiss the ring and let them bow down, looking for the time of your life taken. As in, like, taken from. The options are, because I'm nice like that. <laughs> this is gospel. 
Miss Jackson, Stormy, or Glory. I'm not allowed to do that because it confuses <laughs> Stormy? Is that an option? Stall at me. Oh. Stall me. I think it's from uh, Miss Jackson. Kiss the ring and learn and bow down. Correct. I had to really think about that one. <laughs> oh. Whoa. Great job. You've got 11 out of 12 right. That one question. Okay, Brandon Yuri would be proud AF of your knowledge. You would, pr <laughs> you know, probably all there is to know about Panic at the Disco, you little sinner, you. Now go listen to Death of a Bachelor on Always. repeat. And this is the gift Always. that you got. Oh. Oh, I've made that gift before. So I did relatively well. You, you got one wrong. It was an innocent mistake. I can't it remember was. what you got wrong on. The true I've... or false question. True or false. Yeah. Star quiz. Uh, see, if it's about his makeup, then I'm, I would do well. If it's about his life, then I would well. How well do you know about Jeffree Star now? No. <laughs> which lip colours... Oh, which Jeffree Ooh. Star lip colour are you? No. Oh, I want to know, though. Should we do that? Let's do that together. Okay. What colour What colour am I? Bear in mind, all of mine are there and have every colour except one which will haunt me so I'm still trying to look for it. One beauty essential you can't live without. <sighs> I hate these questions. You tell me and I'll tell you if it's on there. I'll also answer for you. Mm. One beauty essential. I'm gonna go with eyeliner. Eyeliner? Mm. You are wearing it today. Mine's um I'm usually always wearing eyeliner. Concealer. Oh nice. So eyeliner is that's all you have that. Ooh, so pick your favourite <laughs> Jeffrey Star lyric. Oh mate. If I can't be beautiful, I'd rather just die. Same. So let's go die. <laughs> I'm gonna break your heart and get away with murder. Don't get me wrong, I throw my hands up to, on the dance floor. Yeah. The most iconic one is coming. So it's, we're gonna party like it's a prom night. We're gonna party like it's prom night. And I want a love so good, so good that it will make me sick. Oddly romantic. <laughs> um, well, it's gonna be the top one from, because it's from Beauty Killer and that's an absolute tune. Okay. I was gonna go with, I'm gonna get, gonna break your heart and get away with murder. Love that. How would your friends describe your personality? Oh, you can answer this one for me. <laughs> you know what, I'm gonna say funny. Oh, thank you. Because we have a lol fest. Lol. The many a Starbucks we nearly got kicked out of. <sighs> we need to go back to a Starbucks. A dance move. Oh, mate. I'll see you for Oh, God, they're all really bad. That is such a me thing, so I'm gonna go with the kid. <laughs> I love Anla, but she's never seen Friends. I actually have. I've I've seen a couple of episodes yeah, all the way but through. Yeah, you don't understand the references, so no, you I don't can't really. say you've watched it. I'm sorry. There's three more <laughs> questions. Awesome. What smell do you like best? Ooh. Strawberry, watermelon, cinnamon, root beer, or vanilla? Strawberry. A pet. Ooh, is a dog there? Yeah. That one. Yeah. So we're gonna go doggo. Love doggos. What merch are you most likely to pick up at a concert? A CD slash vinyl, a wristband, a flag, or a band tee? A banty. Yeah. I do have a flag. Your favourite Jeffree Star hair colour? Oh, it's got to be the classic pink. Which one do you think mine is? I think you like the blonde. Yeah. <laughs> so just pink. Just pink. Just the classic pink. It's iconic. Hey, so we have found out what lip shade you are. Remember that? I forgot why we were doing this. <laughs> um, the result is posh spice. Oh, controversial. It's not one of my faves. It's not what I go for. Yeah, well, you're gonna have to start going for it. No. We're not do you, in. Do you want me to get posh spice? Yes, I do. I mean, it's pretty. Posh spice, that's me. <laughs> brown. Posh spice, that's me. <laughs> brown. <laughs> it doesn't look brown on the picture. No, Is it, it looks... because she's maybe got like an olive skin tone? Maybe. Look at me. So white. I literally like look like I matched that print. Goals. Okay, so can we get can you can we guess your age? Oh okay. Based on your taste in Panic at the Disco songs. Mate, let's do this. I'm probably gonna get like 13. Oh please don't. <laughs> you can only pick one. Oh mate. You're ready. I'm ready. 
I swear that's there. from that. You liar. Well, yeah, but he wears it on stage also. Okay, let's see. <laughs> so, one is, lying is the most fun a girl can have, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Mm. Or, hey, look, ma, I made it. Uh, lying is the most fun. And what's it gonna be? So the next one is, there's eight of these, by the way, just to get you Yeah, cool. So, nine in the afternoon or roaring twenties? Roaring twenties. Don't threaten me with a good time or let's kill tonight? Don't threaten me with a good time. Sorry, my cousin sent me videos from a Australia little thing. Gold. Fuck off. Sorry. <laughs> uh, so the next one is, I write sins, not tragedies, or northern downpour. Uh, I write sins. I'm really disappointed. What? Northern downpour. Yeah, but you have to be in a vibe for northern downpour. Which hence is the Ryden thing, because now they don't play it because Brendan Urie gets emotional. Because Ryan wrote that song. Oh no, mm -hmm. not the, not the confirmation, sorry. <laughs> and then... Oof, did I see shirtless Brendan? Cause like... I don't think it looks like... Shut up! I don't know what he looks like. <laughs> oh my god, that is literally him. I know what he looks like now, it just doesn't look the same. So, Kamisado? Kamisado, yeah. Yeah, that too. Girls, girls, boys. Oh, the both banger of tunes. Oh, girls, girls, boys. LA Devo 2. Yeah, or Miss Jackson. LA Devo 2. Why do I keep going? I'm sorry, Miss Jackson. Ooh, I am for real. Is that not the same? Is that who it's not that? the same song. <laughs> Wait, what did you choose? LA. Yeah. Oh, thank God, because <laughs> that's what I did that actually. One. Um, and then it's, but it's better if you do, or victorious. Oh, no. That oh. should have been your thumbnail. <laughs> that. Oh, and then no. I'm laughing at the camera. Oh. They're both really good songs. But it's better if you do. <laughs> and last but not least, Death of a Bachelor or High Hopes? Sorry, I'm singing High Hopes. I know, I can tell. <laughs> Oh, it depends what vibe I'm in. What vibe are you in now? Oh, I couldn't listen to either now. <laughs> the on screen grabs I'm going to get from this. Uh, um, Death of a Bachelor. Okay, oh, calculating oh, results. How old do you think they said that you are? Well, if it's going, if it's getting. Accurately, then it would say 24, but it's not going to, so I'm going to say like 20. Am I right? You're 20! <laughs> I don't understand that reference, but you can have a look at it. That is from the music video uh, Emperor's New Clothes, and it's really creepy. Yeah, when I first it. watched it, I died. Okay. And that is all your questions. Whoop, 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 whoop. So I did relatively well. You did. In the actual quiz one. Mm -hmm. So I'm proud of myself. I'm very proud. Thank you. Okay, that was the video. Comment down below if you want to. Your fandom, because let's have a little fandom discussion. I once went on the chat roulette <laughs> with my friend and we pretended we were really big One Direction fans and like stringed this girl along. <laughs> pretending that we were really big fans and then we were like, psych, and then disconnected. <laughs> anyway, Sorry, I was a little bit offended as an ex One Direction fan. Uh. Anyway, Hi. please do give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and hit subscribe down below. Obviously, Rogan's information will all be in the description box, so check it out. Uh, and we're going to film a video on your channel. Doing exactly the same, but can you test my Has a Pozza quiz? Has a Pozza! Has a Pozza! Now, we're both Harry Potter fans, but I'm not very good at trivia. No, not with Harry Potter. Not and with Harry neither Potter. Neither am I, to be fair. So, but. let's see how this goes. So, check out the video. And until next time, see you later. Bye.